think it really impacted my life because when we first met Jesus, I mean, I say we because it's very common to to happen to all of us. We tend tend to think God as a, you know, this heavenly old guy father, you know. And I I sort of have to go through this transform of thinking what really God is and is his community. And he in this community, one serves the other. And between them, they were one, but they are three person. All of them have distinct roles and they serve one another. And when it's applied to, and, and when I learned that we are made in God's image, it's not just that because God sees and then we see. Because the Bible says God's hand, we have hands, not that kind of image only. But that we are made to, to reflect the structure of respect of different roles being equal and serving one another as a family. And that point really impacted my life when I learned that um, because as I said, we inherited this wrong vision about what it is to be a, a man, what it is to be a, a woman. And then what was when I was confronted to the, 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 the Trinity part and to on how to be a family, the, the dynamic and that dynamic being applied to my family, it really changed the game on how I think. And I have a pastor friend of mine. He 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 said a while ago, "Do you ever uh, realize that we have to be something that we were not never taught how, how to be on a daily basis? Do you realize that we're giving something that we actually don't have, never had? So the the challenge for us is much bigger." Because it's only by the grace and the truth of God and the gospel that we are able to pass it on and break this, you know, cycle in our lives as a family, families. And I, I feel very challenged and very um, blessed to see I'm not able to apply a hundred percent yet, but I, I have the perfect model to follow mm. 